Hello guys, welcome again to my tutorial. So today I will give you some knowledge of how to insert the object based on bitmap and vector format. Okay, let's go. So I will use uh, flaticon.com here to find the object. Okay, you can find, this is icon. Okay, this is uh, special for icons uh, service, so uh, you can get free image icon here. Okay, so I will use the keyword sport, and you can roll it up, and then you can find a one fitness free icon. Just click. So there are two types uh, formats: the bitmap ones uh, with the PNG and the vector with a scalable vector graphic or SVG so I want to download both of them so first the PNG we click here and you can click free download and you can click a copy link just copy link uh, to use attributes for your work and then I will close and then you can save again the SVG format and you can click free download again and copy link okay we have uh, two files here okay let's go to the PowerPoint so I already prepared this text okay and just want to show you the difference of the two kind of formats okay okay uh, I will use the insert menu pictures and there are two formats here PNG and SVG. So first I want to click the fitness with PNG insert okay here and then insert again pictures with the SVG format here okay it look like same but it's different okay we have to scale it first okay put here and then put here So if you click the bitmap one, the PNG or JPEG here, if you zoom it, okay, you see that's a uh, pictures created by pixels. So you see that's a broken picture here because it's based on the pixels. Okay, okay, and click again. But in here, you see that I zoom it so a very sharp. This is a factor based on. Okay. In the bitmap format, PNG here, if you click the format menu, you can only see the format uh, editing color, for example, here. You can change the only format color here. Okay? The format colors. Here. Okay? And when you right click here, there are no group ungroup here active it because this is based on the bitmap okay now see in the factor based on okay when you click the object here in the format you can see the fill and stroke actively you can click all this image by click change the color but all color will be filled automatically so you can change the line here black here you can see the line okay okay i want to undo and when you click uh, in the object right click here and you can see that group it here group here and you can choose ungroup this is specially for the svg not all svg created by ungroup but this is the one is the can be ungroup group and ungroup so this is a warning just a warning from Microsoft PowerPoint this is an important picture not a group do you want to import um, to a Microsoft Office drawing object yes of course and then you click right click again group and ungroup it again so we can uh, see that's a broken pictures with each shape factor base 
so you can click it and you can change the colors for example like this and you can see each image you can change the colors and the other advantage if you're using the factor base uh, you can create animations detail here for example like this I will use the fade and then using outdoor events so you can see that animations with a detail SVG, WMF or EMF formats so that's very easy isn't it so have a nice try and see you for the next tutorial thank you mm -hmm.